All right, Ryan's back. <clears throat> Full look at the forecast. It looks like today might be a okay day to get out there because it looks like there's some stuff coming later in the week where you probably don't want to be outside. So. Yes, today going to be the mildest day of the week, Lee. Thursday, especially though, some colder stuff on the way. We'll start with where we are right now. Some flurries, very light snow showers over the last hour drying up in York County, but we're continuing to see snow showers in the mountains of northern New Hampshire and now getting going in the western Maine mountains too, especially along and north of Route 2 around Rumford, Farmington, up toward the Carabasset Valley. Some flurries and very light snow showers are out there this morning. Any accumulation should be confined to the higher elevations, but I can't rule out a slick spot or two especially around Route 2. 34 right now in Lewiston. It's 33 degrees in Portland and also 33 in Bangor. But to the north, it is colder. Berlin, New Hampshire, 27. Rangeley in Greenville at 23 degrees early this Monday morning. We do have some wind out there now, and the wind will be with us much of the day. Wind chills feeling more like the upper 20s in many spots right now, and that will be a factor into the afternoon. Cold front coming through this morning, but the real serious cold lags behind it, and we're really not going to cool down in a big way until Wednesday night into Thursday. High temperatures today between 35 and 40 in most of central and southern Maine. We'll still have a breeze coming in out of the west between about 10 and 20 miles per hour. And you can see some of the flurries, the snow showers that will be out there this morning. The afternoon is partly to mostly cloudy with still a chance for some snow showers in the mountains. Tonight we'll start to lose the clouds. I think by morning we are mostly clear with lows in the teens to around 20 degrees and then tomorrow we'll have some clouds returning in the afternoon. It is a little bit colder tomorrow though. Highs in the upper 20s to lower 30s. More closer to average though uh, tomorrow. The average high is 31 will be 32 in Portland for the high tomorrow. Watching a weak weather system which comes in tomorrow night into Wednesday. This will bring a round of flurries and snow showers again perhaps a coating to an inch in spots by Wednesday morning. But the theme this week, again, no big storms, despite the colder air that's going to be moving in. I think Thursday morning we'll have temperatures in the single digits to around 10, and then Thursday afternoon highs only in the 20s before another system brings another round of flurries and snow showers Thursday night into Friday. The reason why this cool down later this week is such a big deal. We haven't had a below average day so far this month temperature wise averaging nine degrees above normal in Portland, Augusta and Bangor and a staggering 13 degrees above average in Caribou. Very unusually warm this month. Seas four to seven feet with a westerly wind 20 to 25 knots. Small craft advisory is in effect. So flurries and snow showers continue in the mountains, particularly today, partly to mostly cloudy everywhere else. Colder tomorrow, upper 20s to lower 30s. Snow showers likely tomorrow night into the first part of Wednesday. Cold start Thursday, then another round of snow showers expected on Friday before chilly air builds in for the upcoming weekend as well. So Lee, as I mentioned, 20 is really not a big deal in January, but when you haven't had a day with below average temperatures, it is. When it comes to the weather, my friend, it's always about perspective, isn't yes. it? Yes. So, all right, thank exactly. you very much.